Let's take a look now at the track map there. You see the 11 turns, obviously dead flat, no elevation changes. Going into turn one, probably the fastest entry that you've got. You've got to be very careful going through two and three. They're pretty slippery. Four and five, you've got to make a good shot out of five because you overtake going into six. Make a good shot of seven as well because another good break of one is eight. Let's go on board now with Jack uh, Baldwin here as he goes through turn one and two. This is turn two, tightens up a little bit. Really two and three, almost turn into a big double apex left-hander. Then you've got this little right-hander. Now you want to come up well here because this left flick really is nothing because you want to really get some speed up down here as you come down to turn five where you might be able to do some outbreaking on the inside here but it's not really close enough to get but it's just quite there. Turn six rather. Now turn seven. Another one where you really want to be right under the wing of that car because as you come into turn eight there's a golden opportunity to get by somebody before you get up under the banking and those very fast back straight. Because unlike the circuit last year, they now go through NASCAR's turn. Our turns 10 and 11 would be NASCAR's turn 3 and 4. So very fast. By the time they get around to turn 1, they're really quick.